find the poor. Yeah, I think somebody hit it in the parking lot. I, yeah, I did not talk about that, but who says you can't take a load on a motorcycle? Definitely not trippy. Hmm, my shittiest tie-up job, but uh, it's gonna be funny if it, yeah, it might fall. It'll be funny. Will I make it, guys? Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Gotta love having a bike. I don't care. I used to do this with the e-bike. Why not a motorcycle? Oh God. I'm sitting too straight up. Why do I have a feeling? My wallet's in my pocket. My phone's in my pocket, but all my pockets are done up. Not done up. That's what I mean. Okay. We stop for a sec. We do up some pockets. Oh yeah, the ones, the pants from Harley G's. Hell yeah. Yeah. Of course, of course, this shirt came from Harley G's too. Come on, come on. Yeah, so, I don't know if you guys heard about the floor board yet. But I came out the other day, uh, yesterday for me anyways, and the tarp, we, oh, the, my tarp was under the front tire, my bike was totally crooked, like, what the, Jesus, buddy. And, um, like you could tell, first look at it, it looked like someone tried to push it, and because of the steering lock, it went like just an angle like that. And then, and then they pushed it somewhat back, and I'm like, someone tried to steal my bike, so you know, Trippy, he goes on a rampage. I go out, start giving it a couple gears, come back. Couldn't figure it out, so you know, that's bent. Tipsy and I will probably be fixing that today with some pliers and, uh, Oh, I got lots of time, so I'll wait and not go straight and cut through, but... He's probably like, oh, look at that guy. I just waved to him. He has a toilet paper and Kleenex. Huh. Shit. But, um... Yeah, it pisses me off, so... You know, I did a video. Pretty sure somebody tried to steal my bike. One... How the fuck did that cover get under the front tire too? This is straight. I've never parked my bike or anything other than straight. It's fucking three. Yeah, I fucking might not be able to tell in video, but hold on, let me try to put my foot on. It's like should be straight. Yeah, I can pick it up. I wonder if this somehow got bent down here, because well, there isn't even a single scratch on on anything. Like, this would have hit first. And there's, it's shiny. It's not even a fucking scratch or dent. Push the bike the way the bike was. You have this scratch mark here. It's hard to see. like the bike got pushed over another weird thing is unless I put the cover on it's hard to say but look at that look at that line okay hold on okay so let's say that was like that you know I think that's exactly what it did calling out haters the person you know who stole my bike I don't know if it was a hater not stole but tried to um, I didn't know if it was a hater I didn't know um, if it was just someone in a blue moon tried to steal it but I put I made a little two three minute video which I didn't post it because you guys don't need to see the side that side of me if you don't have to you might have for the cannabis plants a little bit but when my uh, plants got stolen, I wasn't that much pissed off as I was yesterday. Who gives a shit about plants? This bike here, you know, it's my baby. So, 
then I was talking to the neighbor, telling him someone tried to steal my bike, and I'm like, wait. And I came back out to it. I'll put this video in if I have any here. Okay, so I was, I pretty much was talking to the neighbor, and then I'm thinking, wait a minute. How is this possible? You know, it just, I was putting two and two together. I'm not trying to take corners because fast as I can. I never do anyways, but I can feel that stuff slipping. And my footboard's kind of messy messed. So like my foot, it's funny. Whee! Yeah, so then I figured, oh, I think, I think somebody hit it. So I went out inspected the car that parked beside me, seen a little scratch on the rim, but it didn't really explain, you know, it, I, I talked to him, of course, I went right to his place, but the way the bike was sitting, like this, when someone backed out, they, and they hit this side, which, thank God, the kickstand was pointing down, because if it was the opposite way, it would have fell over, but I seen a mark on the road, like the pavement, like a, about a foot and a half long scrape that I would like, to, yeah, my bike got hit in my parking spot. They actually hit my bike and pushed it. I, oh, I was so peed off. I got some time to go. Let's uh, do a couple side roads and make this video a little bit longer than two minutes. Is this even a roadway? No, this isn't a road. Damn it. I hate going on sidewalks. Oh, it's hard because I'm holding pressure on my back. Just in case, I don't want to pick that stuff up. Yeah, so I was a little, little peed off. Hey, neighbor people. Uh, let's go down this crescent. Let's wake you all up. Is this just a crescent? Like, does it come back out somewhere? I don't know. Yeah, so I was a little peed off thinking the whole time someone stole a bike. But with the tarp, it was somebody in uh, next to me, and you know I didn't go and threaten the guy. I didn't go and yell at him. I just asked him, simple. I asked him. I'm like, hey, I'm just wondering, did you leave your house at all today? And he's like, uh, yeah, I was gone for a couple of hours in the morning and a little bit in the afternoon here and there. I'm like, okay, that's all I needed to know. I said, somebody hit my bike from your spot. I said, I'm not accusing you. If I was, I would be here on a much different note than I am now. I'm just, I, if you didn't leave, then my theory's out the window, and now I have to be really sketched out. Someone did try to steal my bike, because I thought someone was jumping up and down and bent that. That's what Tipsy and I both thought. Someone was on the floorboard, because they couldn't steal and jumping up and down, so, yeah. Uh, there's going to be cameras in the parking lot here soon. And, you know, if you ask, why didn't you call the cops? Because I don't deal with the cops. I don't call the cops. Um, you know, if they pull me over, they pull me over. But, uh, yeah, I don't call them for anything. I'll deal with shit on my own, or I'll figure out how to deal with it. Like the uh, plants I got stolen, found Buddy, and within less than 24 hours, and you know what? I still have all the information, so yeah, that's all I'm saying about that guy. I dropped all the stuff off. Now I'm going to crack the tire, I think. I still got some time to kill for work, so why not? And I brought, uh, I got a butane torch at work, and um, I brought one with me. And we're going to try to, uh, <laughs> you may say it didn't work, you may be right, but we will see today. Thank you. Mm, I got this big adjustable wrench. It's probably about 16 inches, 18 inches long. Big, old, oh, bad, freaking, yeah. So I might have to heat it up. A little bit of heat's better than no heat as I look at it. I wonder if we can get this e-biker to wave. Oh, I got a head nod, yeah! Let's see what bikers wave at e-bikers. Me! 
loves me. It's not just because I uh, rode one, I have the true belief. I don't care if it's a pedal bike or what it is. It's two wheels, you're on two wheels. Yeah. Uh, oh, my helmet's on. Yeah, so, uh, we're going to hopefully try to bend that. Ah, you car better be coming up behind me. Please, this light will not change, and I'm not going to give it, ah, oh, it's not, son of, oh, but there's a truck, as long as that truck goes straight, or turns that away, I'm good, but if he turns left, I'm completely screwed, until there's a car behind me, I sat at this light for some freaking time, anyways, waiting, how good the truck's turning, oh god, chicky boo, hell yeah, wrap, Oh, so hopefully today, if uh, we can't can't bend the bracket back, it's probably about if mm, geez, it looks like over a quarter inch thick, maybe. And, uh, I want to say closer to uh, maybe three eighths. It's hard to say. I should measure it at work, but if we can't bend it back, then the plate underneath that's bent a little bit. I'm going to strap the piece of wood underneath of it with zip ties, redneck it. And then it should be pretty level with that one. So yeah, shit happens. Realistically, what am I going to do, guys? Nothing. Uh, now, if the bike was demoed, then yeah, I would put an insurance claim in, but it's not. I did, no. I, I'm good, I'm good, so. See what? Uh, yeah. If there was a car here, they would have gotten advanced green. But that never goes for this bike. You guys have that issue? I know a couple of you do. You might have to do some sidewalk. Ah. Oh. Love the power, love the speed, yeah. Not to speed, just the speed to get to speed, as you guys could see anyways. Oh, good old crappy tire. Time to go and spend money on unnecessary stuff. Not so much unnecessary, just stuff I want. Maybe, I don't know, I'm going there to look. I meant to look at Walmart, but I, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, it's so hard to hold my freaking, I have to put my foot like right here. Ah, bloody hell. Okay guys, that's gonna be, uh, that's gonna be it of that video, hell yeah. I can't take my hand off because it rolls back and it's too hard to keep my foot up there. So uh, you're with me until after I go through this light. Yeehaw! So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you uh, like, dislike, share, subscribe. You know, do all that good, good stuff. Hell yeah. And uh, I appreciate all the support as always. You're kind of sketching me out there. Oh, you're turning in here. Jesus. Well, it took you long enough. And uh, yeah, have a great day. Stay tipsy, stay tripping, and stay redneck. Cheers, y'all.